The International Olympic Committee has officially cleared Romania to award gymnast Ana Barbosu a bronze medal, following a decisive ruling from the Court of Arbitration for Sport, CAS. This decision marks a significant moment in what has become a highly contentious situation in the world of gymnastics, particularly after the 2024 Paris Olympics. Ana Barbosu, originally placed fourth in the floor exercise at the Paris Games, now finds herself in line to receive a bronze medal after the CAS ruled in favor of adjusting the official rankings. The CAS decision, which is binding on all parties involved, is based on an appeal by the Romanian Olympic and Sports Committee, who argued that Barbosu deserved the higher placement. However, this ruling has ignited controversy, especially in the United States, where American gymnast Jordan Childs was originally awarded the bronze medal for the same event. As of now, Childs remains in possession of the medal, and U.S. officials have indicated that there are no immediate plans to return it. The U.S. Olympic and Paralympic Committee, USOPC, has expressed serious concerns about the CAS process, citing what they describe as significant procedural errors during the hearing. According to the USOPC, from August 6th to 9th, crucial communications from CAS were mistakenly sent to erroneous email addresses at both the USOPC and USA Gymnastics, USAG. This mistake which was not corrected until after the deadline to submit objections, allegedly deprived U.S. representatives of the time needed to prepare and present a meaningful defense. In a statement released Wednesday night, the U.S. OPC highlighted that they had immediately informed CAS of their objections upon discovering the error. Furthermore, U.S. officials have since produced time-stamped video evidence showing that their appeal of child's score was filed. 47 seconds after her score was announced well within the one-minute deadline. This evidence contradicts the findings presented at the CAS hearing, which suggested the appeal was filed four seconds too late. Despite this new evidence, CAS has refused to reopen the case, maintaining that its ruling stands. The USOPC has now announced plans to escalate the matter by appealing to the Swiss Federal Tribunal arguing that the administrative errors by the International Gymnastics Federation fee, and the mishandlings by CAS denied them a fair opportunity to be heard. As the situation unfolds, Romanian officials are moving forward with plans to hold a medal ceremony for Ina Barbosu this Friday, despite the ongoing controversy. This move has drawn parallels to the recent Camila Valieva doping scandal, where delays in the adjudication process led to prolonged disputes over medal allocations. In that case, the U.S. and Japanese figure skating teams had to wait two and a half years to receive their medals from the 2022 Beijing Winter Olympics. Interestingly, in the midst of this growing controversy, both U.S. and Romanian officials had proposed a compromise, awarding bronze medals to both Chiles and Barboso. However, the International Gymnastics Federation rejected this idea, choosing instead to adhere strictly to the adjusted rankings as determined by the CAS ruling. As it stands, the controversy surrounding this decision is far from over. The international sports community is closely watching how the appeal to the Swiss Federal Tribunal will unfold, as it may set a significant precedent for how procedural errors are handled in future cases. Meanwhile, both Ana Barbosu and Jordan Childs find themselves at the center of a dispute that could have lasting implications for their careers and for the sport of gymnastics as a whole. This story continues to develop, with the upcoming medal ceremony likely to add another layer of complexity to an already heated debate.